Hello friends today we'll discuss the ancient history part the prehistoric age in India India during the old stone age had several migrations and multiple cultures developed the history can be divided into three parts prehistory protohistory and history the prehistory part largely belongs to the period before writing was invented and that was called the old stone age the proto history part was the transferring stage the transforming stage from pre to history and after the invention of writing the recorded events are considered as the history there are few sources both literary and non literary sources for people to discover about the past of india the literary sources included the literature consisting of vedas epics sutras etc and religious biographies etc the non literary part consisting of the archaeological remains the dead people remains the coins inscriptions foreign accounts etc the prehistoric period was largely divided into five parts the old stone age which is also known as paleolithic period the late stone age also known as mesolithic period the new stone age also known as neolithic period and the chalcolithic period which is also known as stone copper age where copper was invented and largely used and next came the iron age which was very important for development of india we look into stone age now stone age was largely a period where writing was not invented and hence the main source of information in this period is archaeological excavations robert bruce foote discovered the first paleolithic tool in india the pallavaram hand axe the paleolithic site was named because paleo meant old and lithic meant stone this paleolithic period revolved around the period during the ice age the characteristics of paleolithic age are that indian people during this time were believed to have belonged to the negrito race and they lived in rocks caves rivers etc food gatherers in this period ate wild fruits and vegetables and largely survived on hunting there was no knowledge of agriculture and houses etc and only later fire was introduced in the upper paleolithic age painting evidences were found humans use unpolished rough stones like hand axes blades choppers etc the paleolithic men were also known as quartzite men due to the largely used weapons of made of quartzite the paleolithic age can be divided into upper middle and lower paleolithic The lower paleolithic is the period extending from the human existence up to 100000 BC. This covers a greater part of the ice age and hunters and food gatherers were the main men and hand axes choppers were used. Bori in Maharashtra was one of the most important and oldest paleolithic paleolithic sites. Limestone was used to make tools. Some of the major sites of lower paleolithic age were found in Saurashtra, Gujarat, Soan Valley, sites in Thar Desert, Chota Nagpur Plateau, Central India and north of Kaveri River, river etc. The habitation sites included cave and rock shelters. Middle Paleolithic age. This existed between the period of 100000 BC to 40000 BC. the tools used were blades flakes etc the use of heavy hand axes were replaced and lighter tools were used important sites in middle paleolithic age includes balan valley in uttar pradesh leoni valley in rajasthan sun and narmada rivers etc the upper paleolithic age existed between the periods 40000 to 10000 bc this age marked the end and late stage of ice age and the climate became warmer and less humid this was the evolution of homo sapiens 
Inve- innovation in tools and technology includes needles, fishing tools, etc. The major sites in the Sapo Paleolithic ages includes Bimbekta in South Bhopal, Orissa, Maharashtra, Eastern Ghats, Chotanagpur Plateau, etc.